Hey guys, so welcome to this, sorry about the creepy chair, welcome to this behind the scenes video for the Wake Up To Tea video. Basically what happened is, I did a bad thing. All the behind the scenes footage was on my camera which I'm recording off now. Basically what happened is, I left the footage on my SD card, because I'm a daily vlogger as well, that fills up within like a matter of days, so I just constantly deleting the stuff. And obviously the footage was in there, and it's gone, so Henry didn't have it either because I never... I would have needed to put it on his computer, so that's my bad. So basically, I'm just going to take you through this this website. Well, there's actually like one, two, three, four, five, five websites. Just some cool Photoshop photos, just for something else for you to watch because I feel bad. So let's get started. So the first website is the one that I got a few of my images off. These are all images that not photoshopped. If you get me, so some of them aren't. Too good. Like that one's alright, but I mean, <laughs> double David Hasselhoff. And there's the one I used, and the photo of him starring in horror movies. There, look. So like, just puts all makeup on, and he's like embracing the fact that he has got a missing eye. That's pretty cool. Look at that. Some skyscrapers, literally sca scraping the sky. That one's quite good. I was going to use that one, but I didn't. Because I thought there's better out there, but it's still quite good. Pretty good. Dear me, I can't speak. That's not bad. A black and white woman. Yeah, these aren't great. There's the one I used of the thingy. The thingy. The cruise ship. And then here is the college dorm collage, it's called. And then the photo, if you just move the camera a little bit to the left, that is what you get right there. So that is pretty amazing. That one, I don't, I don't get that one. I've looked at it a load of times and still don't get it. So we'll go on to page two of this website. See, that is a roller coaster in the sea after the um, Hurricane Sandy, which is it's quite sad, that's what I'm saying. I think that's just like some street art to make it look like a hole in the city, and then if you look at it from a different angle, it looks like nothing. <laughs> a giant guy emerging from this random river, that's pretty cool. What's this one? Oh, it's meant to be like a dinosaur dragon skull. That's not real. That's pretty cool as well. They're all pretty good. Look at that. The day the ocean turned into a giant beer. It is like a giant beer. I don't know what happened here. Let's have a read. Oh, it's a dust storm developing near Australia. And this one's cool as well, they're all pretty cool. Like this guy creates 8-bit art and puts them in public places so people can walk past them. And there he is, making them out of little cubes and stuff. Stained glass spider. And finally, this is, <laughs> I can see why this is number one. Just look at that, the longer you look at it, the funnier it gets. Like, he's not a dwarf or anything like that. It says here, he's by no means a dwarf or abnormally hairy stute child. It's a professional soccer player. It's just that the photo is he's leaning back at such an angle it makes him look like he's about three foot tall. You can see Fellaini there. Looking like an absolute giant. So that's that website. Moving on now is the one that Henry used for his building shot. And there's this photographer that takes all these awesome building shots. Like, just look at the symmetry going on. Hold up. Hold up, there's an advert, please. Go. Just look at the symmetry, that's awesome. I should be doing this scroll thing for the whole video. Yeah, there's just loads of them. That's cool. I don't know if it was it that one that he used? I think it was that one. I pointed at the screen then, not that you can see. Yeah, look at them there. How cool are they? Whoa, they're just so overcrowded, it's unbelievable. No idea what that is. But that's that little article. And then these are some like viral photos that are actually fake. So I don't know if anyone, any of you have seen any of these. But there's a, um, a solar eclipse from the International Space Station. It's fake. That short, I've seen that, I didn't really get it, but it's fake apparently. So if I've changed anyone's life, there you go. I haven't seen this one, but someone doing bunny ears on Vladimir Putin. That's fake. Sorry to Bershey Bubble. Um, Marilyn Monroe and... Kennedy, like, uh, yeah, that's fake. 
Uh, don't get that one. A security camera outside George Oswell's house. Orwell's. Wow. Yeah, some of these I don't get. Just look for yourself, I don't really. Fake album arts. Fake Nazi sweets. Um, that's all that. And I've seen this one. That was quite obviously fake, wasn't it? I don't think we need a clarification that it wasn't that it was fake because if you open a window on a plane, the plane's just gonna go <laughs> straight down and die. The fact that he's got like a GoPro on a rod, trying to make it look realistic. Yeah, well done. And there's the one that Henry used as well, the giant grasshopper. I think it'd have been a bit easier if it had used the giant bunny. I'd have got it a lot easier. So that's that. And then here we've got, this is probably the best website, the one with the Obama photo in a party. And then this guy, he photoshops celebrities into parties. So you can see Emma Watson there. How realistic is that? That's just insane. In fact, no, it's not just one person, it's different people. There is Barack Obama, Bill Murray, Tom Cruise. There's absolutely thousands of these. Well, probably not thousands. That one, I don't know. Just the fact that he's got a beer in his hand and just fits in. That's awesome. I don't get how they do it. Flipping Jackie Chan. Look how realistic that looks. Why? I really don't get it. Never heard of him. Sorry, if anyone's offended. Snoop Doggy Dog. Yeah, these are just cool, aren't they? So I'll not look at them all. Oh, there's uh, Leonardo. Uh, house party. Yeah, I'll leave some of them to go and check out for yourself. One more, David Beckham. There he is. So that'll be linked below to go and check out. And then here's the 9-11 one. That was quite obviously fake because... I don't know why I didn't say this in the video, but how... The camera on the impact would have just... And then the fall down would have just destroyed... And the SD card was destroyed, so I have no idea how the photo got recovered. But it was fake anyway, so that's that. And there we go. There, there's some cool photoshopped and not photoshopped photos for you. There's the little dwarf guy again. Oh dear me. So I hope you enjoyed this sort of rushed behind the scenes. It's not very good, but it's something for you to watch, isn't it? So there we go. I hope you enjoyed, and tune in next Tuesday. And we'll have another main video out for you guys. See you then. Today we're going to be challenging each other to guess which images are photoshopped or not. Because on the internet, every...